Appreciate your help with this, Frank. What are you doing? You're gonna let her go? She'll get a warning. A warning? I want her done for trespass, vandalism. I want her off my land. It's a Māori land, not yours. Your lease means nothing. Tina. This is your doing, isn't it? Sabotage my drainage. Send your daughter in to do your dirty work. Oh, some chief. This chief built the church that you pray in, Mr. Montgomery. Given the circumstances, the officers decided that a warning is an appropriate measure. So I do hope that you can agree with him. If I catch her on my land again, I won't be responsible for what happens. Papa, na na te puhi i tira ki kia wata i te whenua hei wahi moana kau me ana taiapa. Kore roa mina tātou ka hia hia kai moana māna ke te ki. Te taku ta māhine. Para te aro o te tika, me te aro o te hera eni hei whai māu. O ka whai a hau i te ara ka whai hua. I kura ai na koe e au ka tū mai koe hei ara hii tō tātou iwi. Kore kau ke mō te hoki mai he tāngata hara kamuji. Hey, Mo, hit it. I'll fuck up on the two to the two nine. Why came my na here on the chitter? Why came my good to call a white time a hot air on the chitter? Are you talking on a poke of fifty? Let the who are what the who are here are one a quay. Mau are not all man. A hundred and thirty 
25 years this has been going on, enough is enough. If we alienate the Pakeha people, we will never get out of there. Never! We must work together! What do we do? In 1840, Maori owned 66 million acres of land in our country, our Aotearoa, New Zealand. Then our ancestors signed the Treaty of Waitangi. And today, we barely have two million acres left. <laughs> My father once said, never sell your land even if you're down to your last penny. He knew that in order to face the challenges of the Pākehā world, one needed to be smart and learn Pākehā ways. I do worry that if we do not act now, we may lose our land altogether. In the gum fields today, there was talk of a new land scheme. And why would the government help us? Banks won't even give us loans. It would put our land in their debt, but if we worked the land hard enough, we could pay the debt back. And if we can't? They'd be setting us up to fail. You know that. Apira Nangata is holding a meeting in Otorua and I would like to go. They won't want a woman there. Ai, Puritia Tonutia, Kiga Tikaga, Aotato Matua Tipuna. Tengari, me fai whakaaro hoki tātou ki te mātauranga a te Pākehā. This land scheme means machinery and equipment. It will give you the ability to farm your land in a new and modern way, yielding results that otherwise would be impossible. I believe this is an opportunity. This is an opportunity for Māori to run their farms at the same pace, if not faster than the Pākehā. He ao huri huri tēne, ki amatāra. This is a new era, and we must be ready.
You look at these as if you've never seen anything like them before. I haven't. We don't have carvings in our houses in the north. No? I've heard about the North's embrace of the Catholic Church. The Church has nothing to do with it. The Church encourages our culture. And yet, the Murai have no carvings. ないだ。エフィナ。え、テウリ、お、ヘレミアってわけ。聞いてよ、ごめんと、カハ、もうてパカ、ツヒツミ。パカコとてまぬか。取りてこい。本前てモニエアピ。カリロココエ。ギラロ
government to acknowledge what is happening to Maori land. We want to have it back. We want to be equal. Kapai, kapai. We have joined together, not just Maori, but Pākehā and Maori, all of us together, Kotahi Tato. And we'll stay until the government recognises our grievances and returns our land. And we're prepared to fight if we have to. I beg your pardon? Fire. You must realise we can't just march all this way. Build this momentum and then disperse. We need answers to our demands and we will stay until we get them. I don't know where you're getting this from, girl. This cannot be a violent protest. How will it look if you stay there fighting? Communities are rising up all around the world. Indigenous people, workers, downtrodden people abused by a system that doesn't give a damn about them. Now is the time to fight back, collectively. Fire, we love you. Everyone here loves you for your guidance and everything you've done for us. But things are changing. We are changing. This isn't just your mission. This is for all of Māori to decide. <laughs> I see. I see. Why? Why? You agree. But there are still rules. <coughs> Endless recitals or getting on with the business that needs to be done. Stop arguing with me, woman! I help you with the farms and with the fundraising for the church. Richard, if our people are not ready when they come to inspect. All those fellas, knowing I can't control you. William Cooper. So you're who they sent to audit us? Native Land Consolidation Officer. Is your husband in? You want to see the land, right? Uh, I'll yes. just get ready. I must say your progress is most encouraging. Nazi Kuri are only just clearing their units. As Apirana Ngata would say, competition increases productivity. But you already know that, right? What's that, 120 yards? I saw you only put in 50 yards of ditch. Well, we can do more if we want to. It's our land. Do you disagree? Not at all. So we'll keep going all the way up here. 
and then along there as far as we want to. With the slope off the bank for self-sustaining drainage. Just making the land work like everyone else. If only more people thought like that. I hear things went well out there today. No. Oh. It's a very impressive work you've done. Working every hour God gives us. You know, there are a number of other development schemes that can learn a lot from you. People you could help. Would like that. Would enjoy sharing our knowledge of the land, wouldn't we, Finn? What are you doing? Oh, I... I didn't ask you to clean up. Oh, there's no trouble. I wanted to help. We don't need your help. Do you understand? We're fine. Carla, go to bed. Take your brother. Perhaps I'll turn in as well. I would like to continue. Sunrise. I'll wake you. Good night, David.
used to come here when I was a child. The family that lived here were friends of my father. They owned all the land around here. As far as you could see. They miss one piece of paperwork and it's taken from them. ご飯もあったりとか、今日はこうだにはまっていってきな。いつやつは。ご飯ないね。ご飯もあったりとか、今日はこうだにはまっていってきな。いつやつは。ご飯もあったりとか、今日はこうだにはまっていってきな。Your father used to sit right there when he needed time with God. Go be with Richard now. You know, he is lucky to have you as his wife. And he is a good Catholic. He will soon be sitting next to God. Thank you, Father. I will lift up mine eyes unto the hills, from whence cometh my help. My help cometh from the Lord, which made heaven and earth. Behold, he that keepeth Israel shall neither slumber nor sleep. The Lord is thy keeper. The Lord is thy shade upon thy right hand. And the sun shall not smite thee by day nor moon by night. The Lord shall preserve thee from all evil. He shall preserve thy soul. The Lord shall preserve thy going out and thy coming in from this time forth and even forevermore. Eteho, Hariatura. No. I have to go back to Rotorua. Then go. Can we not at least talk? I said no.
and I need to speak to you. We need to talk. I'm busy. Okay, then, well, I'll help you. Don't be ridiculous. What are you looking for? Yeah. Yeah. Let me help. No, I don't need your help. Please, I don't please need... let me help. Thank you. You. I'm sorry about Richard Finn. I truly am. I submitted my report to the Commission. They were just as pleased as I was. You did it, Finna. You succeeded. E wiri, e kōpu ano. What? E kōpu ano. Kia koe. Should know the answer to that. I think I can feel him. You don't know it's a him. Ko hea hea au, kia whakahui huitia mai koutou ki konei i te rā nei. He take tāku ki a koutou. E kōpu anau. Engari, e hara ko Richard te papa. Ko wiremu kupa te papa. Ko taku hia hia, me moi tūturu maua. Tau e nare kā koe! 
Are you ready? We have united to open the eyes of those who refuse to see, to see what is right in front of them, the loss of our land. We will march the length of this island to Ika Maui, from the top all the way down to Parliament House. Oh, A sacred hikoi to bring us all together. Te ropu o te matikite, those with foresight. That is what we are, that is what we must be. <laughs> We will encounter opposition of every kind. Be prepared for abuse. This is what people do when they are afraid of you. They will try to provoke you. Do not be violent. Rise above it. Be proud. Only then will they know we are serious. Even our Maori chiefs have said this march is wrong. That Maori only march to war, never peace. Well, I say we march for both, Aye. war and peace. Aye. We march. We march to be seen. We march to be heard. We march to wake the conscience of the Pākehā to make the people of our country know not one more acre of Māori land will be stolen. Wow. Not one more acre. Not one more acre. Maranga mai e te iwi. Maranga tari me te rā. This morning from the New Zealand Broadcasting Service. Sir Apirana Nata has begun preparations for the Waitangi Centennial Celebrations to be held at Waitangi on the 6th of February, 1940. This momentous occasion marks 100 years since the British and Maori people signed New Zealand's founding document, the Treaty of Waitangi. That's all you do. You line it up, you breathe out slowly, and you squeeze. You better listen to us, son. Hey, Dad. Your mother's Pangaru shop shooting champion. Not anymore. Well, I doubt they found anyone better. <sighs> Doesn't get it from me. to what we talked about. It's been seven years since we left Pangaru, you know. The land's no good anymore. Kurigam gone. No logging. It's 
gonna be harder and harder to make a living. The best thing we can do for the children now is get them an education. Use their heads, not their hands. And the schools in Auckland will allow them to do that. What's the talk around the Waitangi Centennial? I wouldn't know. The committee will have their hands full. Well, if they're organised, they'll be fine. We used to do that sort of thing all the time. Not what the numbers are talking about. Well, that's their problem then, isn't it? Mum, I'll take them. Thank you. I agree. The land is no good. They must use their heads now. the Treaty Centennial coming up. Sometimes I wonder what we're celebrating. Our land sold from under us. The power of our chiefs in the dust. Our culture scattered. But if things are to change, we must change them. I need people I can trust in positions of responsibility. I'm hoping you will be one of those people. I'm not sure I am one of those people, Luppy. Whatever you have been through, Tina, I know how capable you are. What is it you'd like me to do? Catering. He's not serious. It's an important job. It's beneath you, Finn. Well, someone has to do it. It's someone. It's not you. You should be welcoming the dignitaries, not cooking for them. Well, perhaps he's right, Woody. All our choices have consequences.
Ah, uh, there she is. The great Fina Pewaki. Miss Ngapuna. I'm surprised she's even here after all that sordid business back in Pangaru. Always nice to see you, Mahina. It's a big day for me today, Fina, to have my mana recognised this way, to be the one to lift the tapu from the marae. You must be very proud. Te hia kaiana taku whāmari. Mauri a mai he kai mamātou, Fina. Kaiana, nō ku te hōnore. Mau te pae o te whare takahi. Ngā tāngata nō rato i a tāne e tuiha nei tū mai te toki. Haumi e hui e i tāiki e. Koko he. Me tona agua mate a tenei, te tapu o tenei hui ngā haka hirahira. Kua ngō i a ia, tenei wahine mkua re marika. Nā tenei mahi kai apu, kai raro ke a ngā pui. E mohi, nāu te mana i tuku ki a whina. He hai. Nā te mea he tika. 
Koe ia te tamahine a here mi a te wake. Rangatira o ngā timanawa, o te rarawa, o ngā puhi. Mā koe hoki ki ngā maunga, ki panguru, fetu tairi ki te rangi. Ki te rākau patapata e tūana ki te hauauru. Koe ia e a heiana, ki te hiki i te tapu o te whare hou. Ki te whakamāria, ia tāne mahuta atua o te wauku. E mōhio ngō, Mr. Wake. Nā nā tonu e hinga te rarawa rawa ko a ngā pui. Ka tohe tonu mātou. Mō taku he e te rangatira. Ka hore kai rawa he, take ma mātou ki kua nei. Hei kua nei. Kua tika waku kōrero. Kua pono. E kore e tā e te whakahe i āia. I should have known asking you to cater was dangerous. <laughs> Uppy. I cannot dispute your right to do what you have done, but it is the way you have done it that is the problem. How are we to bring our people together when they are constantly leaving in anger? Every day, I navigate not only tribal differences, but Māori and Pākehā worlds. I do it because I believe in a future where we are closer together, not further apart. <clears throat> I'm sure you have enough to do in the kitchen. There's nobody left. Uh -huh. Ngāti Kuri won't work for me anymore. Wai ho māku tonu e kite. He aha, te aha. Like you could do it some help there, Auntie. Gabriel? Are my eyes deceiving me? Since when does Pangaru send its angels to war? <laughs> well, I guess even angels have to fight when they're caught. These your friends? Kia ora. Your friends now fire. Orders of Wapi. Let's get to work now, boys. So how are things back home? Kind of happy to leave, to be honest. Why is that? The place feels like it's dying. There's no jobs. Nobody's working the land anymore. A lot of fun are moving away to Auckland. Isn't someone doing something about it? Who?
We need to go home, William. We need to go back to Pangaru. It's my home. If we go back to Pangaru, we will never be at peace. I'll make sure of that. Here, we will build a meeting hall where women can speak alongside men. We will have carvings that carry the stories of our ancestors. This is how we will bring hope back to our people. This is how you ruffle feathers, Tina. Now let them be ruffled. Who will do the carvings? I've already sent word out to Te Arawa. I've asked them to send their master carvers. They will teach us. Let me get this straight. You want to build a marae where women can speak with carvings made by another iwi. A meeting hall, not a marae. And yes, I only hope Te Arawa agree. Mum. Mum. Te Arawa. They're here. They've come to join us. of the Maori people regarding our land. Rangatira, pick up the pen 
and join us. You will see that it has been signed by leaders from nearly every tribe in the North. This will bind us together. All Maori together. All Maori together. To show government that we are here. We are united. And we will not allow one more acre of our land to be stolen. So long, Join our sacred quest. Do what is right for your people. suffering with chronic arthritis. You know, not long ago, I could not even get out of bed. I lay there and I thought, well, this is it. I can do no more. It's time for me to die. Then that night, I had a dream. I was in heaven. And I saw all of my old relations. And then I saw Jesus. Oh, oh where? <laughs> I could barely look at him. And I said, oh, please, Lord. I want to be here with you and my husband now. And he said, no. <laughs> He said, you have much more to do. And oh, well, now I know why the dear Lord left me here to lead this sacred march. <laughs> so I better not let him down, eh? Oh, okay. Hey! <laughs> what is going on out here? Just getting some fresh air fire. Sit down. You know, people have been sent home already for this sort of behavior. We're just relaxing, fire. What's the big deal? It helps us get through the march. Helps you get through the march. Is getting our land back not enough motivation for you? What do you think people are going to make of this, the ones that are watching us, waiting for any reason to shut us down? Then we just won't get caught by a... Too late. Get your stuff. What? You are not needed. So leave. You can't be serious. I am deadly serious, girl. Fire! Far out. Now, you two came to me and ask me to lead. So now you need to decide if you stand with us 
or leave with her. Sorry, Fayo. Finna, there's a lot of talk in the community. You're building your own marae. Why? Hey, mihi tonu mau kia koe ano. Not a marae, a meeting house, a home where our young men from more can return to. Kainga ke to rato. You insult our marae by building this. You insult Te Rarawa and the people of Waipuna, and you cause further insult by bringing in carvers from Te Rarawa. I know we haven't always seen eye to eye. But this isn't about our past anymore, Fina. You need to stop what you're doing. You need to send the Tearawa covers home. This will all end badly. If I had consulted, do you really think that they would have let me do it? It's the first time I've seen him smile since he came home. Father Mulder, I'm so pleased you could join us. I hear you are leaving us soon for Auckland? Yes, that's correct. Please, let me show you some of what we have been doing. These are our tanifa. Our Aiteuru, Niwa. They are the guardians of the Hukianga Harbour, the protectors of our land. They will help to heal our people. And God, Fina, how have you healed things with him? William and I are married now. We intend to live the rest of our lives in accordance with the church. I believe that God has forgiven us. I would hope you feel the same. That's between yourself and God. Thank you for the tour. My work here coming to an end. I've had a lot on my mind. But you're wondering what I've achieved. I'm worrying about what the future might hold for Pongaru. I would like to express my immediate concerns, and I hope you hear the urgency of my words. Thou shalt have no other gods 
before me. And thou shalt not make for yourself an image in the form of anything in the heaven above or in the earth beneath or in the waters below. So yesterday I bore witness to wooden carvings that were perhaps the most offensive and grotesque idols one could possibly imagine. Reproductive organs, they were on full display. There were idols giving birth. So it was disturbing, disgusting imagery that no Christian should ever be exposed to. Excuse me, Father, but you are wrong. Oh, how dare you! You should not preach about things you do not understand. Trying to threaten us with damnation? We here are the Lord's most loyal servants. And who are you to speak to me in my church Lord like this? Father built this church. And I'm not going to sit here and listen to you preach ignorance. Come on. And anyone else who agrees with me. The problem with people is that they can't see what they need until you put it right in front of them. <laughs> what? Nice to hear the old you again. I don't know who the old me is.
hide my name. Maybe I'll keep the glory. Hello, my name is Josephine Cooper. You're Josephine Cooper. I've rented this house. I'm sorry, but it seems we no longer have availability. But uh, I'd already arranged. I'm sorry, I can't help. Excuse you. me. What are we supposed to do? I'm looking for Father Mulder. Bishop Mulder? Not here. Oh, well, where is he? I'm sorry, you'll have to come back tomorrow. No, please. We need help. We have nowhere to stay. This is not a halfway house. No, it is a house of God. He who oppresses the poor shows contempt for their maker. Whoever is kind to the needy honors God. Brought my family here for work. This isn't any. Couldn't find anywhere to live, so. so my, my wife, she. She left. Took my two, two baby girls with her. What about Marae? Where do our people gather? I don't know. The pub. It's the only place we're welcome. And you? Do you have whanau here? I have none here. My husband died. I couldn't pay rent, so they put us out on the street. Hasn't anybody reached out to you to help? Some ladies invited me to some meeting. Well, what meeting is this? Māori Women's Welfare League. Sounds like a waste of time to me. There is serious overcrowding and risk of infectious disease spread. There's no jobs. There's no houses. Our people are arriving in the city and there's nothing for them to do. They can't see their family. Our people have taken to the drink. They don't even know what's important anymore. Can you blame them? People drink when they are feeling hopeless. In this situation, they're hopeless. Get organised. Well, if you want to stay here arguing in this hall, then keep going. But if you want to do something about it, you must get organized. 
Strength comes from numbers, from being united. If we can get enough of us together, we have a real chance of solving our problems instead of sitting here, fighting amongst ourselves. Well, you say there aren't enough jobs. Look around. There aren't any houses. Nobody cares. Not the church. Not the government. That's the problem. The only thing that will make them care is numbers. Real numbers. Statistics that we get from getting out there and surveying Māori. You know, the government, it doesn't listen to angry voices. The government listens to paperwork. Huh? So we give them so much damn paperwork, they'll do anything they can to get rid of us. <laughs> And most importantly, we must look at ourselves. We must educate our women, teach them how to cook, how to sew, how to run a home. Sanitation, nutrition, gardening, looking after our babies. We must take care of our children. Take care of what they hear. Take care of how they feel. For how the children grow, so will be the shape of Aotearoa. That's all I have to say. Tamahi <laughs> atte mahi. Let's get to work. Good morning from Radio New Zealand. The headlines. The Māori Land March, led by Fina Cooper, continues to make its way down the country from the far north. Starting with only 50 people, the march has continued to gain numbers and momentum as it travels the 675 miles to Parliament in Wellington. Crowds are reported to be gathering on the roadside to support the movement. Three children. So you all sleep in the same room? Aye. Mm. And how are you earning a living to support your family? Uh, we've been down in a few months, odd jobs here and there. Mm -hmm. Anything I could find, but it's hard to find them. 
Do you have running water in your home? Yeah, yes we do. You do. What about electricity? Sometimes, yeah. Kilda. Kilda. You feel like you're going to walk? Is this where you're living? Why don't you come with us and we'll get your kai, eh? Anna Cooper. I see you're elected president of the Maori Women's Welfare League. Sometimes positions of power weigh heavily on the holder, do they not? Part of my job, Father, is to ascertain the needs of my people. And this includes their spiritual well-being. Maori are not welcome in your churches, that is very clear. As a result, they're not attending, and you are losing some of your most devout members. There's many problems that we are facing, but I don't wish for this to be one of them. Very well. You consider it done. Look, there are things in my life that I regret, and so more than others. My days are spent converting people and forgiving them for the most heinous sins. But who will forgive mine? Oh, forgive me, Fina. That is between yourself and God. Thank you for your time. Now, did you remember to organize the housing application for the Hawaiians? Yes. And what Fina, about the food parcels for the uh, Onehunga preschool group? Fina, listen to me. You need to think about what we're walking into. The fact that you've only been to three meetings in the last five years has not been well received. The committee has not helped me make decisions in the past. I'm not about to start now. Ngā whare, te noho kainga, te hauora, ngā tika ngā te iwi, whānau. It's all I have time to think about. So glad you made it today. Yes, yes, thank you, Francis. Now, shall we begin with a review of the year's activities? There is a more important matter to discuss. In the time you've been president, your persistence and energy have been a major asset to the League. In recent years, it seems things have slipped. You don't attend meetings. You make decisions with no consultation. 
Your way of doing things is what was needed in the past, Finna. But it's not the past anymore. We are looking to the future. A future where your way of doing things no longer works. And are you all in agreement with this? Aye. Aye. Well, thank you all for your time. with Monday's morning report. The headlines, the Maori land march ends near Parliament today. The Maori land marches will reach their final destination, Parliament, today. 2,000 marchers spent the weekend at the Marayan Polydora and are just beginning to leave down Wellington. They're expected to be joined by supporters as they move along the motorway. I don't know what to do. Why don't you ask it out of bed? You can do this. A few weeks ago, maybe? Come on, Fina. All right, you need to get her up. Get her moving somehow. She's in pain. When I lift her, she cries. Mm -hmm. Then you need to keep trying. I can't help her. You need to talk with me. We've come to talk about the land. The return of stolen land. Māori land. Lead us. No one hears us, fire. And no one cares when we speak, but when you speak, people listen. All people. You could make our voices heard. I've been fighting my whole life, boy. My fight is over. something. for the fire.
Marangara. And the news is the head of the Lowry Land Lodge B is Wellington. Our reporters say the column now seems to number in excess of 4,000 people. It's been joined since early this morning by young and old, and in spite of rain, which set in late in the morning, the march's spirits are still high. I wish you to receive this memorial of right signed by the various tribal elders of New Zealand. Greetings to you in whose assembly is vested all the powers to amend and adjust all laws which inflict injustice and hardship upon the Maori people and in whom is vested the power to confirm all promises which were made to give relief to the indigenous people of New Zealand under Her Majesty's Magna Carta, long live the Queen. Your Maori people pray. He kunea ninihi, he puanga tohura. Ka hoki mai nei a hau ki pangaru, ki papata, ki te raha koe tū patapata, tū ki te hawa uru, ki aru warei, ki ara parapa, ki nga uri o whare whare te rangi te anga anga titi i o i te rangi, tū te raha. Let us all put our heads together in unity. Maori and Pākehā together. The upper house. Upper house. Let us all remember that this treaty was signed so that we can live together 
as one nation in our terror. 